Hey guys, how are we all doing today? Raymond here, and today I'm back with another video, and this is what is in my bag. So, this weekend, or probably right now when you're watching this, we're out shooting the drag races. So, I just want to kind of go through all the gear I'm bringing and why and what I normally carry to a shoot. So, here's my bag, and it's a Case Logic bag. I think it's the Contrast Pro, I believe. Something like that. But yeah, so it has a lot of pockets and stuff. So we can go through the first thing. It's my laptop. So this is a 15 inch 2011 Mac Pro, I think it is. It has an i7 processor, 8 gigs of RAM, and a 240 gigabyte SSD. All in this, so it's perfect for editing on the go. We have the one terabyte Western Digital My Passport. This is great for traveling, backing up footage goes right on that USB 3.0 so it's really so it's really quick you can open up this top it's like a quick section and then you just pull your camera out so the camera I'm using I'm always carrying on me is the Sony a7 it's a full frame camera I had the Canon 70d before this but then I sold this because for three reasons Full frame, the frame's bigger, so a 17mm lens is actually a 17mm lens instead of like a 27, 20 something millimeter lens, so it doesn't have any crop. Number two, Sony is better in low light because their grain, their noise, or whatever, is circle. Canon's is all pixelated, so it actually looks more like grain, so it's more softer and it kind of looks a little nicer and it's better to work with. Camera. On this is a 1740 Canon F4L lens, which is okay. It's great for pictures. It's not great for video because it has a short focus throw, so from here to here. So close up to infinity focus, that's not that much. When you're doing like video and stuff, you want to have it to almost turn around the whole lens to get from far away to close up. In the top here, I have extra anchor USB battery. I have tons of memory cards up here, business cards, and cords, stuff of that nature. Well, actually, let's take a look at the pocket out here. We have the wireless microphones. It's a Rode SmartLav, and then we got the Asden Pro XD wireless lav system. So, one goes on the camera. This one, the actor will hold in his pocket. They have the lav mic it'll go into this and you can get good audio so you, no matter how far away someone is you can always pick up their audio. The other lens I have is a Tamron 28-75 f2.8 lens great for low light stuff also my vlogging camera also my second camera backup camera Sony A5000 with the Sony 16-50 to 3.5 power zoom lens and it's great because they're both Sony and I can have the same color profile on those two cameras so the footage will kind of look the same. And then we have the Joby Gorillapod. This is what I use for vlogging. I can hold it up, hold the camera out in front of me. Also, I can attach this onto just about anything. It's great when I'm doing time lapses and stuff like that. I can hook it on to objects and stuff and get like the coolest time lapses. GoPro. GoPro Hero 4 Black, shoots 4K at 30 frames a second, I think. This other lens is a Canon 85-300. to This is an FD lens. I also have an FD adapter. What's great about this is this, it's all manual. And then also, I have my filter, or my adapters and lens caps and everything like that. I have Tiffin, uh, Polarizers and different. This pouch right here is just full of batteries. So always have extra batteries when you're going on a good shoot. And last but not least, the Glide Cam. This is the Glide Cam 2000 Pro. One of my favorite things for filmmaking. Helps you get nice, smooth shots. <clears throat> also, a DLC slider. So you can also set it up on the Fluid Head tripod and get some awesome sliding shots. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. My name is Raymond Rainer, this is 316 Films, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this, and leave a like rating. Peace.